Hello everybody and welcome back to some Morphine Folia. I've been told time and time again to give this a go and I don't know why I haven't yet, so let's do it. I think this is it. Easter egg found, G Fuel. Okay, I think this just starts up a run as G Fuel. Okay, I'm still getting this, uh, this bloody thing showing up. Wasted my active charge. Here it is. Okay, let me just go and do debug, is it eight? For active charge, there you go. Yeah, just to get my active charge back, I can disable that now. And then do this again, just in case. But yeah, this is G Fuel. I don't know what to expect here. I have been told that it has something to do with guns. And it's really crazy. But I've been, a lot of people have been telling me to do this daily. It was a daily, it's now a, it's, it's now a seed. But anyways, we pick up this, we get a thousand points. And we get um, quite a lot of stats, and we are cracked out of our mind. But yeah, this is for some sort of promo that they did with G Fuel. What in the shit did that ma- <laughs> Okay. Oh, is this where the Baby Plum thing was from? I saw a bunch of memes being posted of Baby Plum getting fucking exploded by some sort of ballistic missile. And I had no idea. I thought, I thought it was just a meme. Is this what this is from? Oh, I'm excited to see that. Oh, the twins is pretty good here. So, this is pretty cool. Um, I'll re-roll that. Cootie. Uh, familiar that charms the non-boss enemy with the most health in the room. Ew, gross. Fair enough. We'll give it a go. Yeah. So, we, it seems that we just start with the 1G fuel. Um, I like that. That's really nice. It's automatically charms. I'm loving these massive explosions. This is so cool. I don't know what these points mean. I don't know if they're just for visual effect or if they actually add up and it's some sort of like point progression, but goddamn. Okay, so maybe maybe it's not about guns, maybe it's more about explosions. <laughs> I like the way uh, it changes enemy depending on what's currently got the most health in the room as well. As for the question of the day today, what is your um, G Fuel of choice? <laughs> do you um, do you go for any energy drinks or anything like that, or is coffee your G Fuel? Or are you staying away from caffeine as I am at the moment as well? Where does your... Oh! That's... That's really cool. I kind of like the way that they're, like, low quality. <laughs> That's really nice. Okay, yeah, it doesn't work on bosses, of course. Goddamn, this monster is huge. He's a big boy. He's a big boy. But yeah, I've been wanting to try this out for a little while. I, I do wonder, can you play um, the seed as any character? I don't actually know. But um, I thought, why not give this a go? Seems like it'll be a good amount of fun. Slap you about, my good big boy. Whoa! So many explosions. And then, burn hair juice. It's decent enough. We'll get a burn out of it. We can fill it up straight away. Down to the next floor. Yeah, this seems, this seems interesting. Oh, wait. Okay, we get another G Fuel. May affect all stats. So now 1,200. Good amount of extra stats there. Oh, okay, here's the gun. Okay. <laughs> I'm loving these, like, nuke effects and stuff. Oh, there's, like, little G Fuel cans on the floor. Okay, here's the gun that I, that I heard about. I didn't really know much about it, but yeah. Oh, my God, there's explosions going. I love these explosions. I really like the way that they're kind of, like, low quality. I think that's really funny. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Where Isaac with a gun. Where Isaac with a gun. Isn't there meant to be a gun item in Fiend Folio? There was at least one like hyped up or revealed before the uh, mod came out. I've never seen it if it is in the game. Maybe it's just an Easter egg thing. I don't know. There's so many hidden things in Fiend Folio. This is crazy. Lost Worm, pretty good. I want to keep this trinket first, try and smell it. Because this one is when we pick up pennies, we have a chance to smelt our trinket. So if we can smelt this first, then we can start smelting other stuff. But Lost Worm... Lost Worm is actually really tempting, though, because it would be really wacky with this setup. Oopsie. Or at least I think it would. It's actually really strong, this. We're, uh, we're kind of destroying stuff right now. Do -do 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 cool that we can play with this with like additional mods and stuff on as well. Oh, don't walk directly into the fire, you goober. Q. 
<laughs> I really like this. I'm surprised you can't get a similar item to this in the vanilla runs, but I suppose it makes sense because it is a little bit out there for uh, Isaac. It's not exactly normal, is it? Right, die, you fiend. There you go. A big explosion. That's pretty decent. Check this out. Take Gimpy, reroll, take Incubus. Incubus shoots the gun too. That's that's exactly what I was hoping for. Let's see what Lost Worm does. Okay, yeah, we'll take this. We'll take this. Wacky shots. Bit of homing, spectral. I like this. Really, the key jumped over there. Why? And then we got time itself. Has a chance to fire multi, um... I don't know how to pronounce that. Tears that, um... Do that. Can be shot through doubling tears. Basically, it turns everything into multi-dimensional babies, I think. Interesting. So, as I understand it, we're likely to get another, um... By the way, the, the twins trinket would be super good right now, but I'm sticking with what I've got. We're likely to get another G Fuel on the next floor, right? I don't know what a second one would do, though. I'm not entirely sure. I'm not entirely sure. We, we did get another one. Cool. Misery up. Oh, okay. Now it's like a minigun. So is each floor it's going to, like, increase our fire rate, or is it just going to change the way that we fire each floor? Either way, I'm down to clown with this. This is... This is pretty fun, and yeah, with this with this lost worm that gives you like wacky herming and stuff, pretty fun with this setup. Gimme, gimme. Is the game sped up a little bit as well? The music definitely sounds a little bit sped up. I feel like the game is because we're on G Fuel. The game is like slightly sped up. But yeah, this is basically like the soy milk of this gun, and I can get behind that. Especially with Incubus firing extra shots. And this time itself item, whatever it's called. Creates some pretty good stuff too. All the explosions too, it's just so... This is such a fun, weird seed. I'll have to throw this into the series every now and again. I need to play a bit more of the uh, Delete This challenge as well. Because the Deleted has that sort of air about them, but it's not quite the same. I do want to hop back onto the doing another Deleted streak soon though, because I know you guys love it. I know you guys really enjoy the deleted streaks. Hop back on another one of those at some point soon. Right. Minigun blast everything. Having the, the highest HP enemy in the room always charmed is honestly so damn good. So it basically just makes sure that the highest enemy in the room isn't attacking us. Which is normally the strongest enemy in the room, so it really works out. I'm loving all the point pop-ups as well. It makes the game feel so different. It's so sort of foreign. Fucking crazy explosions and everything. It's just wild. I'm wondering what our next iteration is going to be. Is it going to be... I'm, I'm curious to see if, it, if it's going to be faster firing or if it's going to like alternate between this and the gun or if it's going to be an entirely different thing. Maybe it's not going to be a gun at all. Oh, oh, I really hope we get like a rocket launch or a grenade launcher sort of style at some point. If that's in there, I will, I will shit a brick. That's going to be so cool. Yeah, that's what I saw. That massive explosion then. That's exactly what I saw. Um, I'm going to reroll both of those. Solomon's actually kind of decent. Um, I'm going to take a risk here and take Judas's Shadow as well. And we got that revive there. Right, next floor. What do we get here? This time we get... Let's have a little look-see. Oh, we got a shotgun. Nice. Oh my god, this is strong. This is really, really strong. Oh my god. The, the amount of screen shake that you get with this as well is actually just... A huge part of the fun right now. Also, everything's confused when I walk in the room for some reason. 
What was that about? Was that just because of how much I'm shaking the screen? Imp Soda, what a great item to go along with this. We can literally crit with our shotgun. We can get headshots now. Oh shit. I did die, but I'm back with a lot more damage. This thing's gonna be a lot more potent. Especially with crits mixed in there too. Oh my god. Nuked him. Golem's orb's brilliant for us. What is our next iteration? I don't know what's coming up from now on. But it seems to be evolving each time. Mixer. Ooh, what's... Like a sort of DMR sort of thing? The bullets are coming out backwards. It seems like sort of a DMR style thing. Like really high damage, slow fire rate. Maybe just like a quick firing sniper rifle. Oh shit. The screen shake is just getting to the points of absolute absurdity. It's so hard to actually focus on what the hell's going on because the screen is just shaking so much. I'm getting hit loads and I don't even know what's happening. I mean, I'm going to take Nancy bombs just because maybe the explosions that are happening all the time will trigger Nancy bombs. I'm pretty, pretty likely that's not going to be the case. But, because it's not a real explosion, but I have to try it. We got Fire Mind out of this. I like the way there's just explosions for no reason now. We open a chest and something explodes. It's funny. Get corn. I'll check this at least for HP. Nah. I was hoping I could, like, pick up a, an item that would give me more HP. The music's definitely very sped up at this point. <laughs> this is like a proper machine gun, but it's got fire mind on top of it too, which is making it look even more awesome than it already would have. This is so cool. <laughs> oh, this is just absurdity. Oh my god, I'm so fast. Why do I have 2.6 speed? What, what the hell? I broke the speed cap. Since when and how? Oh my goodness. <laughs> This is so fucking cool. This is such craziness. Every floor we just get cr Oh my god! 2.6 speed! Isaac was never meant to move at such breakneck speeds. Look at this! <laughs> Woo! My god. I need a key. We're just wiping the floor with every room right now. Oh my god, what is next though? I want to try and get a key here. Oh my god, the speed. No, I don't want that. It's very hard to actually accurately navigate right now. There's a key. Oh, balls. <laughs> I got hit so much doing that. Tears have high knockback, but you also get knocked back on firing. <laughs> it just instantly crashed the game. <laughs> Be right back. Balls. Okay. Um, I didn't unpause 
I'm in boss rush now. I apologize. <laughs> I've been like commentating for the past like three minutes and I was like, wait, it's still paused. I don't know when I paused it. Anyways, we're back. I'm in boss rush. We just got knockout drops and compound fracture. Knockout drops is a, is a lemme getting with from Solomon. Honestly, this is just wacky. It's so crazy. I apologize you missed some of this, but look at the nukes dropping. I've just been having the absolute best time with the seed. It's such... It, it's just it's just stupid. It's lovely stupidity. Yeah, compound fracture especially is causing some craziness. We're killing most bosses in pretty much an instance. A single instance of time, but other ones are taking kind of a while. Infestation, not great. Like this guy, he jumped up and he managed to kind of escape us, but... He all dies in the end. The explosions, they, they reign supreme. Bad blood. Got weird gish here. Wherever weird gish is. Should be on like the last few waves now. Unfortunately, you guys did miss quite a bit. There you go. Quince? Nah, sad bombs potentially not very good either, but I want something I want tier effects. I wanna I want my run to have cojones. I want my run to have big balls. Ooh, we've this floor's looking strange. Hey, we got rocket launchers. I was like, I really hope there's a rocket launcher or a grenade launcher. And we got it. And it's it's compound fractured rocket launchers too. We also did increase our speed, so it happened. Did that chest give me nothing? Thank you. Oh, God. I do have the wafer now. Um, I got the wafer from my item room instead. I don't know if you guys got to see that part or not. I'm not sure. I don't think so. But yeah, pretty useful for us right now on this floor. I want to be really keeping my distance. Is that a door that just hit me? God damn it. Yeah, I really want to be keeping my distance round about now. Gimpy helping us out here. Thank God I took Gimpy. Especially with the wafer. Gimpy plus the wafer is super strong. But on this run... Does, does any of that really matter? The explosions aren't actually as good, you know, as the regular shooting, I don't think. It's still hilarious, though. I'm, I'm, I am really curious to see what's next. Really curious to see what's next, somehow. Like, how is this going to evolve? Really? Oh, wait, I've got enough speed. Can I, do, I, do I have speed to do this? Sometimes you have enough speed, you can... Nah, I don't. Damn it. You can kind of, like, phase through things when you have really, really high speed. There seems to be a lot more enemies showing up as well. Is it, is it just doubling all enemies right now? It seems to be maybe just doubling all enemies. Yeah, it is. Or maybe even tripling in some cases here. I'm hurting myself a lot. I think it's tripling. I didn't notice that for a little while there, but goddamn. Adding a little bit of challenge. Compound fractures definitely making things more tricky. I really like the way the fires are like pink. Like how am I meant to avoid taking damage there? This just is what it is, isn't it? There's just completely unnecessary explosions here. It's beautiful. Give me that. Right, what, what's next in the docket here? What could possibly be next on G Fuel's lineup? Okay, I think we're at the maximum evolution now. I think Rockets is the final pit stop. But that's not great for us because they are uh, tricky. <laughs> I just love the explosions. We're just going to have to hope, hope and pray we don't kill ourselves. Because there's not 
much we can do to avoid hurting ourselves in certain situations. Some of them, we can actually... Oh, I never finished this room, apparently. Some of them, we can actually play correctly and not hurt ourselves. But a lot of them, it's just down to the whim of the game. Like this one, for example. I was too fast to not accidentally walk into stuff there. Pfft. It's just beautiful nonsense, this is. Beautiful nonsense. The double soul heart dream. But well, somehow having the health to get through this, and I don't really know how. Like I said, I think Gimpy's keeping us going. Every room is just a complete nightmare fuel full of explosions and numbers. Gimpy saves the day again. And again. We're actually gaining health from Gimpy at the moment. I'm actually trying to focus really hard on making sure I don't die at the moment. Things are dying very quickly, but still, things are scary. Um, Burn heart there. I'm going to try and do hush, because why not? <laughs> Seems like a terrible idea, but honestly, maybe not with the explosion damage we're dealing. We got more G fuel too. Okay, nice. Oh, we got back to the shotgun. Okay, this is good. This is good. That could be... That could be crazy. That could also be crazy. Okay. Fuck me. Okay, this is maybe not great. I have very little ability to see what's actually going on right now. I don't even know where the enemy is. Shielded Tears should help us, though. Shielded Tears should do a good job. The seemingly infinite amount of explosions on this guy should do a good job. And so far, that is true. Enigma Bomb's here. I did get hit by something. I don't know where that bomb ended up. <laughs> it's just like a firework display. Located directly on top of this guy. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know it would like devolve back to the shotgun. I'm kind of happy because I like the shotgun more, I think. I think the shotgun and the rapid fire AR are my favorite versions. Though the rocket launcher one's fun, but so deadly. Gimpy, thank you for the double soul heart drop, wherever that came from. Okay, you're almost dead, my good fella. But this seems to be an explosive shotgun, which it wasn't last time, so maybe it isn't a devolve. Maybe it's more of an evolve. He's gonna do the, the lightning. The beam from the sky, but he didn't actually manage it. We're good to go. We can go up, 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 I think. Yep, up, up, up. God damn. So another G Fuel. Hi, up. Okay. Not quite sure what to think of this. This seems to be incredibly quick firing, very, very large shots. But just 3.4 speed now. Oh my god, there's so many enemies per room now. Oh my god. <laughs> the music as well. The game's playing at such high speeds. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Enemies are uh, uh, multiplying at uh, an increasingly rapid rate here. Yeah, just the mini boss. Had to even pay attention. I walked directly into that fucking fire then, just because the speed is too much. I phased through that key. <laughs> it's just ludicrous, the amount of speed. I really like the way it ups the difficulty by just increasing 
the number of enemies in the room. Kind of works. Makes it all things a lot trickier. Especially with the goddamn screen shake. It's the screen shake that's making everything so difficult. Thank God I have Gimpy. I would be nowhere without Gimpy. I'd be dead without Gimpy. <laughs> I'm really enjoying the music on this floor with it being this sped up. Rubber cement? Oh my god. I basically can't move without moving directly into the enemy. There you go. Last floor. We don't have any keys though, so no extra items. We do get another G fuel, so we'll see what that does for us. Mix up. Oh, we're back to we're back to the rapid fire. This is the strongest one, I think. Everything dead? Nope. Everything dead? There you go. Oh my god. It's be such a hard time just traveling between rooms. Apple, thank you. <laughs> this has been an absolute blast. An absolute blast. Glaucoma. Okay. We're almost there. I wonder if we can just walk directly over spikes without getting damaged if we're at full speed. I love the point pop-ups. It's so satisfying. Oh god, I'm taking a lot of damage though. Thank god we have the wafer. Gimpy to keep us going. Those double soul hard drops are super, super crazy. Like, they're really useful. Kind of broken that that can happen. It is a mod that adds the double soul hearts into the game, so... Cricket's head. Nice. That's a 12 damage. What the hell? There's all these bodies that I can't... What the hell's going on? I can't kill these bodies. They're just dragging me around the room at lightning speed. I can't do anything. I just keep getting damaged. What's going on? I literally don't know what's going on right now. There's all these bodies. Okay. That was strange. <laughs> the game didn't like that. Okay. Last little bit. <laughs> oh, the hyperspeed music. It's something else. What? Wait, what? Maybe it's just a can of G Fuel. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Blue Baby is just a can of G Fuel. He's very strong, actually. He's got a lot of health. Look at that. He's flying now. That's so cool. God damn, he has a lot of health. A lot more than he'd regularly have. Regularly have. I can't say regularly properly. Something's wrong with my brain. Right, we've almost got him there. <laughs> this room has been demolished. Goodbye, G Fuel. Ooh, yeah, okay. Okay, we have to see if there's something wacky going on with Delirium. Probably not, but we've got the time to check it out. Why not? Did we pick up our G Fuel? We didn't. Oh, God. We're back to explosions, and it seems to be... These explosions seem to split a lot more than they used to, too. So this is even more deadly than before. How pleasant. I'm just going to have to trust... Trust in the process. Hope for the best. Ah, 
now, Spike Rock. Please be, please be Delirium. It's not, it's Mr. Fred. Mum's contacts, rather nice. <clears throat> Still got no keys to unlock those, damn. You're all dead. Damn it, not the boss. Holy water, potentially decent. There's a soul heart, thank you. Not where I want it to be. What the hell happened here? All those chests come from. Oh my god, there's so many protectors. I managed to walk over a gap there. How is this little thing's alive in this room now? Come on. So many hearts, what the hell? <laughs> this is so difficult to like, keep a straight face with. Oh no, what is going on? A massive flesh in the center of the room. So many of these rooms just do not work correctly with the amount of enemies. Oh, I just realized we have Hurst Hat. There's a reason we're not taking anywhere near as much damage as we should be. Because I have Hurst Hat. Apparently helping a lot. Give us the boss rooms, please. There's a few. We're really only taking damage to contact. That's helpful. Demon baby, why not? Can't fucking pick it up. Yes, hello. Oh, no. No! <laughs> I got stuck. I'm going to have to exit and continue. <laughs> Notched axe or tea. Oh my god. Come on, please be it. It is! Finally! We're here. I literally cannot see anything right now. Not a single thing has ever been seen by me. This is unprecedented. I'm dropping bombs whenever I can, because why not? I, I don't know the last time I hit the boss. I'm getting, like, bullied and pushed around by all the explosions so much. Some of them are black now? What the hell? I barely even know what my character is most of the time here. Holy shit. Oh my god, what is going on over here? Okay, quick, attack, attack, attack. Wow, he's in his normal form. There you go, we got him, we got him. Wow. That was that was that was really something. What a what a fantastically amazing seed. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. That was um not what I was expecting at all out of this, but I, I have to say, thoroughly enjoyed it. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next one.